What's going on YouTube family? Hope you guys are having a great start to your day. I'm back in the game with another video and welcome back to my channel NC Tug TV. So guys, we all know since Wendy Williams went on vacation, she has basically have been burning up the streets, turning it out, getting crunk, doing the stanky leg, hanging out with Black China, chilling with the Kardashians, rolling shotgun with this young man. Um, she's just been all over the place. She has become literally a hot topic herself. Now, I want to talk to you guys about this report that I got from the HollywoodLife.com website. And basically, they are reporting that Wendy Williams finally reacted to her husband love child rumors. So let's run to the receipt and read what she had to say in regards to that matter. All right, and it reads, Wendy Williams just went there. The talk show host finally broke her silence on rumors that Kevin Hunter had a baby with his alleged mistress in March of 2019 and even compared herself to a show pony. Wendy, who is 54, just addressed two of the biggest rumors that swirled around her and Kevin Hunter's 21 year marriage, the supposed existence of a love child and an alleged affair between her former husband and a rumored longtime mistress. The talk show host was photographed on the arm of a mystery man in New York City on June the 11th. But the conversation took a sharp turn from her new fling to her estranged husband's rumored one. Look, my husband had a full baby with the woman he was involved with for 15 years. Where I was cooped up only to be a show pony, now I'm living my life. Wendy reportedly told a TMZ reporter. All right, so guys, I want y'all to take the time out with me, right? And let's applaud Wendy for moving on from Kevin Hunter, someone who cheated on her basically for the entire marriage, right? Had a whole baby on the side, took her money to take care of another woman. Now she's put that whole marriage in the rear view mirror and has moved on to somebody that has a questionable past that has been convicted of robbery. Let's give Wendy a round of applause, right? Because she's moving on to bigger and better things. Yeah, so listen guys, I really want Wendy to live her best life. But at the same time, you would think that Wendy would have the common sense to date someone that wasn't attached to any type of negative background. Listen, she's just coming out of a situation where this girl has been through it. Now you putting yourself in another situation, allegedly, because I still have my questions surrounding this new boyfriend thing, but you're putting yourself in a situation with someone that has been convicted of armed robbery. Listen, it doesn't mean that someone that has a past, a negative past, can't change and become a better person, become a better human being. All I'm saying is I didn't think that a dude with this type of background would be her first choice. Yeah, come on. But anyway, guys, it seems that Kevin Jr. is on board for Wendy to get out there and find somebody that's gonna treat her right. Hollywoodlife.com said that Kevin Jr. is thrilled that she's finally focusing on her happiness after she filed for divorce from his father. Now that's really, really good to hear in my opinion because I was worried about him psychologically. He's already seen a lot, he's already been through a lot, and it's good to hear that he is on board with Wendy possibly finding love again. Now, if this was my mom, she definitely wouldn't be dating somebody else with a questionable background after all she has been through. Now, I know a lot of adults will say, you know, a child needs to stay in a child's place. Well. A child is supposed to protect their mother and protect their father as well, but the boys, they really protect their mom. And if a mom really loves her son, she's gonna listen to her son and understand that he has concerns and understand that those concerns are valid because he just witnessed what Wendy went through. But anyway, guys, I wanna hear from you. So drop down in the comments and give me your true thoughts and assessments on this particular situation. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also share this video. And if you're new here, don't be afraid to subscribe to my channel. And if you're on Twitter or Instagram, you can hit me up there and yo, follow your boy. I be posting things each and every day, all right? So guys, it's been real. I'm out of here. Peace.